So welcome back to another video. Today I'm gonna be doing something new. It's good. It's like I'm gonna do be doing some commentary videos because I think I got an interesting sometimes life. So I was in school. I am not the smartest, right? I, I, I I'm not the smartest. Okay. So I go to extra help on I forget what day. I don't know. Let's go for a little while. Because I have no way to do math because I'm so bad. Then, uh, I was like waiting there. Then my, my friend started coming in because he was like in the uh, like school committee thing. It's like weird. I don't know. It didn't seem like an interest of mine, but like, yeah. Off topic. That's off topic. Um, and then a, a teacher comes in. Like, when, when we we're like 25 minutes late. It was the teacher that I do my extra help with. So, I was like, hmm, why, why are they here? This isn't normal. They come in and tell us that they don't know the full details, but the whole basement, is, that's, that's where they keep the kids, um, was flooded that day. Because, like, some, like, randomly, someone, like, pulled the lever because they were, like, bad at the video game and they're like rage quitting and they're like oh i lost the bed wars game i think i i think i'm gonna go like drown the whole world right now you know that's what i would do if i lost the bed wars game so i was happy like like who's not happy when when something floods and like you're in school and stuff like whenever chaos and susan in school it's just so much fun i guess like i don't know it's kind of weird but at least for me, it is fun. So I, I was like best in the world and I thought school was canceled. So I was happy and I was like, what's up? Like ask is school canceled or something? But they were like instantly said, oh, go into this like gym. Oh, really? We have to do school. And then I was still hoping that school was canceled because no one came in yet, and, like, I don't know if I, like, missed an update on, like, an email or something that they sent us, but, yeah, then we had to move to the upstairs, because the upstairs was, like, not flooded, I guess, because no one wants to, like, be drowning while, like, learning math or something weird like that. At least I would. Wouldn't. Not would. Why would I want to be drowning while learning math? So, like, two days later, they were like, Oh, yeah, you guys are not going into to the basement anymore. And then I was, like, happy, because... Like, like, who wants to go in the basement? So, like, two days after, um... We, like, were told that we... You know, we like weren't going up like to the basement wait up to the, down to the basement again uh, like i was in science class i was chilling okay i was chilling i was just sitting there and i was like not thinking anything would like happen but thing that i have to tell you my school is so beat up okay this thing needs a revamp. Like, it needs to be redone so much. If you think my school does not need to be redone, you are insane, okay? That is insane. So, they were doing, like, some roof work to try to fix the school or something. And they- Oh my god. So, they were just doing some roof work, and then I, like, saw that there was, like, tiny things falling from the roof, I guess, and I was concerned, because I do not feel like dying or hurting myself, because then I couldn't play Benwurst, and that would just be, that would just be bad, like, like, me without Benwurst, I would, I would probably become, like, insane, like, insane, I would, I, I, it's impossible, okay, it's not a thing that exists, I just, like, was doing my work, like normal, like a good person, and I was just like, oh, there's tiny things falling from the ceiling. 
And then my teacher was like, oh, don't worry about it. It's fine. Nothing bad's gonna happen. And by the way, I was the closest person to this thing that's falling. And I was the one who spoke up for it. So I should get the credit. And then like five seconds after she says, oh, it's fine. Nothing bad will happen. I, a little massive rock. Like when I say massive, it, I mean massive. Like this thing was a boulder. It falls through the roof and just literally just falls right next to my hand and I was shocked I like almost screamed I was like a high-pitched guy and I like I'm always high pitched I can scream really loudly and like oh you you're glad I didn't scream then No, 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 please do not die here. I'm not legally allowed to die here, actually. That's illegal if I die. Um, no, I died. I was shocked at this point. Like, like at this point, so it was my first year at that school because I, I moved to Massachusetts like uh, like a year ago now. Um, so I was like, this school is is not good. Like I am, I am scared. I'm like mentally not helping me. So I was just like, okay, I'm gonna back away, and then I just stood up and went to the corner of the room and just stood there for like five minutes. And then she called like the office and stuff to like uh, to like say, oh, there is rocks falling on my students' hands. Um, gladly no one got hurt. Um. If anyone did get hurt, it would have been me. But it's okay. Or Broham, because Broham was also in the room at that time, because, like, he's in, like, most of my classes. And for some reason, they want, like, the, the tiny children to be, like, it. Like, they want the elementary schools to, like, have all of it. They're like, oh, this was my bed? This was my bed? Oh, that was not expected. I didn't think that was my bed. Oh, bitch. Oh my god. 